Welcome to Video Basics, the show that breaks down video making information into what you need to know. I'm your host, Saito Ninja. Today I have for you a review of FX Home Hit Film, a visual effects and video editing application though for the indie filmmaker. Now let's get started, shall we? Now the company FX Home is no stranger to video or filmmaking software, even photo. Over the years, they have came out with several different products, including their lab products, no, which is, of course, Composite Lab, Effects Lab, and Vision Lab Studios, and plus, let's not forget the Photo Key software for those who are interested in photo keying for photo photography. Now, what can I say about Hit Film to start us off? Well, let's start with the box, shall we? Now, on the box of FX Home Ultimate is a serious software for serious filmmakers. Well, in my opinion, it should have said what you need in a video software. Because, yes, my viewers, HitFilm is just that. It what you need in an FX software. are looking for a video editor, they're looking for something that can edit as well as make visual effects. But I only suck! Suck, I say! When they find out that most video editors do not make visual effects. Well, there are several reasons for this. this but the most important one is quite elementary. So then, simply put, there are or several different types of software that most filmmakers use. And there are, are your video editing software such as Sony Vegas or Apple Final Cut Pro. The photo and imaging software such as, well, of course, Adobe Photoshop as well as a free one called GIMP, for example. The audio recording software such as Audacity or the vocal software, yes. The software with those same good. Well, you know what I mean if you're an anime fan. Then, visual effects compositors. This is the world famous this Adobe After Effects and, of course, our very own FX Home Hit Film. Then, writing applications. Microsoft Word and Celtics, for example. 3D and animation software. Bend there for one and just shoot me now. Sound Micro Anime Studio Debut. The pro version is for the. But, but in truth, there are really only two types of software you need, and those are your video editor and photo editors. But hey, what the hey? Hey, compositors like HitFilm are so much fun to play with. Indeed, they are. about the price point of FX Home Hit Film. Why? Because we are all a bunch of cheapskates, so and we want the most bang for our bucks. No but without compromising a lot of quality. Well with FX Home though you get surprisingly good effects quality for its price point. Now the now like many big name video editors such as Adobe Premiere, yeah oh, there are two different versions of effects of hit film no with two different price points. And the first one being in hit film standard which is 150. The end. The one that I'm using is hit film ultimate which is about four hundred dollars. Now let's face the facts. 
No, you're going to be getting the ultimate version anyhow. Hell, so why bother with the standard version? So why you might end up upgrading it later. Come on. No, okay, now let's talk a bit about the ease of use of hit film. Now yes, there is a line curve to hit film, but hit film feels very much like a Adobe Element version of After Effects. For, for, but with more power and professional features than any of the other the, um, Adobe Elements. Man, uh, what I mean by this is simply put, it's feel more like Adobe Photoshop elements to, well, Adobe Photoshop. Well, um, I should also mention that Adobe Premiere elements to Adobe Premiere Pro we kind of a bad example for this, just because I never use Adobe Premiere elements. And yes, I am using Adobe me, uh, me a pro to edit this video, you know, and I also have Adobe After Effects, but okay, maybe I'm getting a little off topic here. Yeah, as overwhelming as After Effects is, but I do think even though After Effects is more complicated than hit film, After Effects is still probably better to run with. But I would still pick. Hit film overhead after effects so for beginner any day. Now if you're new to compositing, which probably most of you are, or no hit film is a good place to start with um again visual effects and compositing. One of the many features that Hit film has to often is a video editor. Now this video editor is basic at best. It's only an upgrade from a basic editor like Windows Movie Maker or something. But it's not going to beat the power of your external editor if you have something like Sony Vegas for example. But this editor is still handy if mainly for editing in editing a sequence or a scene or something. Okay, but as for me, I mainly use this editor for exporting. Okay, but again, it's a handy little feature. Okay, now we are finally going to talk about the heart and soul of hit film, which is its visual effects. Now, you can do Hollywood style you can do Hollywood style visual effects without the blockbuster budget. The hit film has a wide range of both 2D and 3D the effects still to choose from. Here are some examples. Fully the customizable 3D particle engine. The gunfire! The green screen or chroma key like I have here! Yeah, light fuzz! Ah, uh, shiny. Me. Fire! <laughs> Lightning! Beam Sabers? This. The color grading. Why am I all. Sh wow, I'm really different colors now. Now, plus some cheesy effects like the inset vision and. Then the bug splay, which can be used for slime and poop effects. Yes, I know, I'm sick. So, and many more effects that I haven't even listed. Uh, you know what? Now another big feature that Hit Film has to offer is that it's a fully 3D. Compositor, but I gotta say this, this um, 
which is kind of basic. Um, you can import 3D tracking data and the particle system that HitFilm has and it does work in a 3D space. But however, I should point this out that it's not a 3D modeling software. You cannot import 3D models into HitFilm. I mean, this is really, really the biggest downside to HitFilm. You no, know, again, no 3D environment. Well, no fully 3D environment esque. But, but besides on that huge downside, so if you want to do some cool flying effects, you no, know, in the 3D space, which you can, you no, know, you no, know, and do some cool landscapes effects like what I have here. Yeah, neat, huh? Well, now one of my favorite features in HitFilm is the uh, point system, which is uh, this little thingy right here. Here, you know, which work in both the 2D and 3D space, which, uh, which uh, you can make a point and fully animate and keyframe and, and attach all your different layers to this one point. This is something that would save you a lot of time, and I probably should have mentioned it when I was talking about ease of use, but. Hey, I thought I belong here. the visual effects coordinating that you can do in HitFilm isn't as good as what you can do in After Effects with hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of plugins. But, but I still find an FX Home HitFilm to be a great product Not with it ease of use to save time and money, the visual effects quality that you never see at this price point and a great community support. But, FX Home HitFilm is truly a good investment for any video or film maker at a toolbox. And yet, I still find that I should pay more for HitFilm because simply put, it's that good. Well, thanks you guys for watching this tutorial. You know, and hopefully to catch you guys next time. You know, right here on Video Basics. Well, see you later guys.